South Africa, the 15th of September 2017-1224 by Naledi Shankarabo McKenna. Image Instagram KFAB underscore 27 The trial of Sandile Manso, alleged to have murdered and burnt the remains of his girlfriend Carabo McKenna, will only be heard next year. Manso on Friday morning appeared in the Johannesburg High Court, where his case was postponed to 15 March 2018 for trial. Appearing before a packed, heated court, Manso sat in the dock alongside a stream of other accused. He wore a grey polo neck jersey and a green scarf and seemed unfazed by all the cameras and people present in court. An entourage of Macroena's family occupied the middle benches of the courtroom. After proceedings the family huddled together outside the court as Macroena's uncle, T. Shepo, addressed them. Manto's mother and a young woman believed to be his sister quickly left the court after proceedings. Meanwhile, outside the court a handful of Democratic Alliance protested against Manto. Carrying placards with the words no to femicide, the group sang songs calling for Manso to be kept behind bars. The 27-year-old married father of three, who is estranged from his wife, has been behind bars since May. Macroena's remains were discovered in a ditch in Lyndhurst, burned beyond recognition, on April 29. Her family continued searching for her, unaware that the remains that had been found were hers. Manso was questioned by police and had initially denied seeing McKenna, alleging that they had broken up a few months earlier. However, he later confessed to police that he had returned home from a business meeting on April 28 and found McKenna dead in his flat. He claimed to have disposed of the body by dousing it with petrol and pool acid, placing a tire around it and setting it alight. Manso alleged that he had feared that he would have been blamed for killing McKenna, as she had reportedly painted him as an abusive lover. During his failed bail application, the investigating officer in the matter told the court that Manso had told police that he had killed McKenna to sever a blood ritual they had done in order to strengthen his business. His business started to fail once he and McKenna decided to part ways. Manso denied making the confession.